I recently did a video in which I expressed my appreciation for the hardworking members of the Jamaica Constabular Force. And I have long argued that there are more good police officers in the JCF than bad ones, and I stand by that. However, I know all too well that there are still way too many bad apples within the ranks of the Jamaica Constabular Force, and this will continue to be an obstacle in the JCF's attempt at crime fighting. We have heard of some serious crimes involving members of the JCF and whilst there has been an effort to root out some of the bad apples from the ranks of the JCF, a lot more has to be done. A lot more needs to be done. Especially considering the fact that very often the JCF continue to suffer black eyes as a result of its members. For example, a few recent headlines reads as follows. Constable suspected of being a high-ranking member of criminal gang arrested. Cops who robbed Manchester man jailed. Cop arrested amid allegation of boy being molested at police station. Policewoman locked up for 18 months on fraud related charges granted bail. These are just a few of the headlines that shows that the JCF continues to be plagued by the sins of some of its members. Crime fighting in any country is not just down to the police force. It's a partnership between the police force and law-abiding citizens. But there has been a great distrust of the police for a long time in this country and I am not sure it is improving. And until serious steps or measures are taken to treat with this distrust, the JCF will continue to struggle when they seek help from members of the public. As police officers, you cannot be the thing that you are fighting against. Criminals. As police officers, you cannot be arresting people for the same thing that you are doing. I mean, we have heard of policemen being high-ranking, prominent members of gangs, being hitmen, being enforcers, being drug runners, being scammers, being rapists, being all manner of evil. And the Jamaican society is hard enough to police, as is. However, when you add dishonest, corrupt cops to the mix, then the thing becomes increasingly difficult. And yes, I understand that police officers are also human beings and they will also have transgression. However, they pledge to serve and to protect and to be that barrier between justice and injustice. But many of them continue to cross that divide and to hopscotch and skip from one side to the next. It's either you're an officer of the law or you're a criminal. So you need to figure that out and sort out your life. The distrust of the police force did not happen overnight. And citizens have been given many different reasons down the year to continue distrusting the police. So in order for this to improve, the police have to be the change that they see. They have to lead by example. You can't arrest a man for murder today and you're going to murder somebody tonight. You can't arrest a man for scamming this evening and tomorrow morning you're involved in scamming. You cannot arrest somebody for extortion last week but next week you are involved in extortion. You can't arrest a man for his involvement in gangs, but yet still you are a high-ranking member of a criminal organization. You cannot be arresting people for a robbery when you are a mastermind behind many robberies which occur in this country. You cannot be arresting people for rape when you have raped and continue to rape women in this country. So while I stick to my view that there are more good police officers than bad police officers, I will also agree that there are too many bad police officers and significant efforts must be expended in rooting out these rogue police officers and trying to rid the force of these men or else the crime situation will continue and perhaps get even worse. Teach them! Hey yo, hello! Send the message and make it reach them. It's teach them right here, Warlord representing. Thank you for watching. Like the video before you go. Please subscribe if you haven't done so. And remember to share the video with your friends and family. And browse the channel for more quality content. Until next time, walk good, my friends. Teach them!